We live. We working. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's your host, Mr. Hewitt. Wagwan. It's been a minute, it's been a minute, it's been a minute while we're back. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into this one. Wagwan. All right. Let's start this off by doing exactly what we said what we was going to do and go to those quests and let's start from this, this and go straight to the main. So let's just go. Let's go. Let's do this shit, man. Fast travel all the way there, broom it there, done. I can do this, I can do this, they will want to help. Yeah, you just have to have faith, have hope, Poppy. Have faith and have hope. Is this where we're meeting the centaurs? Well, they don't exactly know we're coming, so it's less of a meeting and more of a surprise, I suppose. Um, they'll understand. They won't like this. They'll understand. <laughs> they won't like this. <laughs> Once we tell them about the snidgets, they'll understand why we came and they'll want to help. I hope you're right. Perhaps they'll be able to tell that we're sincere. There's something about them that's so knowing. It's almost unnerving. I can understand that. Centaurs don't know any more than the rest of us. Centaurs are known for being wise. Oh, I've heard that. I suppose they are known for having an air of omniscience. That's exactly the right word. I just... never mind. What is it? It's nothing, truly. I've... We've no secrets to hide. Nah, That's that right. Boots. We'll simply be honest with them about what we're trying to do. They'll have to help us, won't they? Yes, of course. They don't have You're to do absolutely anything. right. Absolutely. We'll meet with them, tell them about the snidgets, and I'm sure to all be fun. So I'm saying, why did it cut like that? Oh, yeah, it's trouble now. Packs. We're surrounded. There's nothing we could do. All I've got is my little wand. <laughs> All I've got is my wand. What do you think you're doing here, humans? Please! We Chilling. were hoping to speak with you. Ah! I suppose you'd like a tale for your friends of the time you spoke to a centaur and it spoke back. No! Never! We're here because we need your help. Enough! You made a grave error in judgment in coming here, little oh. witch. We are so fucked. No, I can just fatigue. Be, Alec. We do not harm the young. It is not our way. Thank God. You forget your place, old fool. I'm the leader of this herd, and while you cling to our way, their kind continues to slaughter beasts like us without a care. From what I can see, they have slaughtered no one. They will leave here unharmed. Thank you, sir. You Mark my words, Doran. If I ever see them again, it will be all three of your heads. Come, try it, do it. With him on our side, I'm a magic wand. You don't stand a chance. And I'm level 29. You don't stand a chance. Foolish children. Do you know what happens to wizards who wander here? Mm. Now, follow me. Golden Scissors are still alive, and the poachers are after them. They know that the key to finding them lies in the moonlight, but they don't know what that means yet. Please help us find the snidgets before the poachers do. Yeah, I beg you help Could us out. Who Help us out, Dorian. In the south, there is a cave within which lies what the poachers seek, a moonstone. Retrieve it and place it in the henge in the forest. I, on the other hand, must go speak with the herd. Find me after you have done this. What, is it the same demigod's moonstones I was getting to get Alohomora, level one and then level two? Who knows? I don't understand. So the moonlight mentioned in the journal doesn't refer to actual moonlight, but to a moonstone. 
What do moonstones have to do with snidgets? And why was he so certain about where we could find one? Isn't moonstone all around us? Yeah. Why retrieve one from a cave? Knowing centaurs, I suspect he's referring to a specific moonstone. We'll likely know it when we see it. Oh, so, we're, oh, so it's not that moonstone. It's the other kind I use to do transfiguration. I don't know, but I am inclined to believe him. What with his being a centaur and all. I am too. It is a shame how quickly he left. What was he his left name? Rapidly. Doran. That's what the leader of the herd called him. Well, if Doran knows something we don't, I'd rather act now and ask questions later. I can head to the library and start looking into the cave he mentioned. Yeah, you do that. I'll let you know what I find. Good. <laughs> On the broom, and I'm off. On the broom, and I'm off. Where's the next one? Rebellion. Knowing the meat, he's likely studied here. Oh no, I've already done that. Because I would have had the symbol on the map, yeah, where I found this one. Distracted again. Detours now and just slap up a cup of money. And I need to do these Merlin tasks too. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Rebellion! Confringo. Like Confringo. Oh shit! It's one of those ones to do quick. Enemy is about why the fuck not? I'm just warming up. Also. Tiger! What a pest! 
about Revelio. <sighs> I'm sure it's about something important. Looks rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. Could it be a murder trial? It is. Rebellion. Do. 
Lumos. Merlin Charles won't get the best of me. Yeah, that's a nice one. We like that. We like that. Even more Charles like that. Simple. <laughs> Revelio. Ooh, to what do we have here? Warm. Are you ready to put an end to Halo? Yes, let's do this. I'm ready to do what's needed to take Halo down. I know you have a plan. We must gather information from the friends of Mr. Bickle that Archie and Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Agabus Philbert, Otto Dibble, and Mr. and Mrs. Rabe. All right. I suggest that you speak with each of them while I head to the Hogshead. I saw some Ashwinders heading there. And as my mother would never go near the hog's head, she is less likely to learn of my activities than if I were to wander the village questioning its residents. <laughs> hog's head. <laughs> Where can I find... <laughs> Where am I to find these friends of his? I do not know about Mr. Rabe, but his wife, Daisy, is often in Hogsmeade, as is Agabus Philbert. And Otto Dibble, he works at Gladrags, so you will likely find him there. Uh, cool. Very well. I'll speak with them, see what I can learn. I knew I could rely on you. We need to know how they are being blackmailed by Rookwood and Harlow. Meet me here after you have spoken with them. Oh, Hopefully by the time you return, long. I will be able to move a bit more freely. Uh, good for you, bitch. Let's, let's go chat to these three individual people, because... I ain't got a life, and that he does. So she's taking advantage of that. Why the hell? Why can't she do it? What do I have to do? I'm joking. Mrs. Rabe should be nearby. Sound like he said rape. Oh, Isco, what have I done? Mrs. Rabe. I wondered if I might rape. speak with you about Theophilus Harlow. Truth is pronounced rape. I'm a friend of the Bickles and I'm trying to gather evidence against him. Poor Joanna and little Archie. And now Harlow has taken my darling Isco. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> I'm a security guard at Gringotts and my husband is a curse breaker for them. Harlow approached me about helping him extort my colleagues into giving him treasures from the vaults. And you declined? Of course I declined. Repeatedly. I thought they'd given up until I came home one night and found my husband gone and a note affixed to my door with a knife. The note stated that I only had a few days to reconsider helping with some banking needs and that my husband would appreciate it if I acted quickly. But the help Harlow wants is help that I cannot give and my dearest Isco is paying the price. Well, that's a lot to take in. Um, we ain't gonna... We ain't gonna Thank you, Mrs. Rabe. Knowing the lengths that Harlow will go to is helpful, albeit more than disturbing. Mr. Bickle was trying to help us, but now he's gone. I don't know what to do. I shall do all I can to get evidence against Harlow, Mrs. Rabe. Very well. Here's the note I received. You must be careful as well. Please don't put yourself in danger. Okay, okay. We're not reading that. Some evidence worth hanging on to. Thank you. <sighs> I hope it's not too late. Now, to find Mr. Bickle's other two friends. Yeah. Mm. 
Otto did all work to Gladrax. I should check there. See, I knew it. These pages, man. I knew there was a page working around here. Rebellion. This is bullshit. I need Dibble 3. Yeah, but, but, but please tell me you didn't take it. But perhaps it's been here all along. Mr. Dibble, may I speak with you? It's about Theophilus Harlow. I have nothing to say about him. Uh, may I interest you in a stunning cravat today? Please, sir. I'd like to help. I spoke to Mrs. Bickle. You know the Bickles? Mm, all right. But we must be discreet. Can't have Mr. Hill hearing this. I know Mr. Hill. He was kind to me the day of the troll attack. Oh, he's a good man. But even he wouldn't understand about Harlow. It started a few weeks ago. I was distracted, reading a note, when you-know-who came into the shop. I hid the note behind the counter and offered to help him. He stared at me for a moment, then asked me to check on an order he'd placed. I went into the storeroom to check on what turned out to be a non-existent order. When I returned, he was holding the note. What was in the note? It was a note from Rosie Hill, Mr. Hill's daughter. You see, we've been, well, secretly engaged these past six months. Ozy. We haven't told Mr. Hill yet. I dare say he has higher hopes for her. Harlow advised me in no uncertain terms that my relationship with Rosie, not to mention my employment here, depended upon my cooperation. What did he ask you to do? It all happened so quickly. In an instant, he took a very expensive scarf from the counter, pocketed this, it, and this smiled. Guy's to bear, isn't it? He said, Your yeah. secret is safe as long as I can supply my lady friend with delightful items like this every so often. Mm -hmm. I've been able to cover for his request until now with some creative bookkeeping, but I can't keep it out for much longer. I'm terrified to say anything. I could never live without Rosie. Yeah, you, you've. You talked well. Thank you for telling me. I'm gathering evidence to take Harlow down. I would love nothing more than to see him rotting in Azkaban, but be careful. He's an awful man and incredibly dangerous. As for Rosie's letter, should you happen upon it, I have committed it to memory. You may destroy it immediately. Understood. Now hurry off before Mr. Hill returns. Where was I? We're on the right track. Now to find the last of Mr. Bickle's friends. All right, finally. This side quest is dead. Whoa! Interesting. Five bills. <laughs> Agabus Filbert must be around here somewhere. He's over there, man. Oh, no. right there, Hello there. Please don't chat as, as much. Excuse me, Mr. Filbert. I wondered if I might speak with you about your dealings with Theophilus Harlow. I hope to ease Mrs. Bickle's mind by gathering evidence against him. Oh, tragic what happened to Bickle. He wanted me to speak out against Harlow for an act of violence committed against me. But I feared Harlow's retaliation, and so I refused. You should have spoken out. You were wise to speak out. Not to speak out. You were wise not to speak out. You should have spoken out. If you had spoken out against him, as Mr. Bickle asked, perhaps Harlow would be locked away by now. Perhaps. But <sighs> perhaps I would have suffered a similar fate. You said that Harlow committed an act of violence against you. Could you tell me what happened? Before my extraordinary wife, Dulcibella, passed away, she had just completed a small book of poetry. As a surprise for her birthday, one she never had the chance to celebrate, I had the book beautifully bound and plated in gold. One day, Harlow came calling to punish me for having spoken out against the Neanderthals that comprise Brookwood's lot. Before I knew it, I'd been petrified, and Harlow was rifling through my home. He found the book of poetry, with its exquisite gold plating. I watched helplessly, lying there in my entranceway as he walked away with the book, laughing as he went. I was shaken to my core. Still am, to be honest. I imagine you fear Harlow retaliating again. But do you mind if I share this information with Offer's a singer? <sighs> 
I suppose I have no choice. This extortion can't go on forever. You can pass it on to anyone who may be willing to help. Oh, God. Harlow does not like people talking, as you already know. I've spoken with Mr. Bickle's friend. Now to he's find Natty. Talking, and he's the one talking the most. That's exactly, exactly my point. You lot chat too much. Chatting a lot. Oh, it's a useless side quest this is. Chat too much. <laughs> Hello, Hamora. We still got it. A minute, we got it. Rebellion. Would that work? What is this? Ah, uh, oh, damn. Damn, you guys. I can't change the days here. I mean, I can't change the time. Don't piss me off. How do you... I'm gonna have to come back for that. I need to sell my gear too. What's this? Yeah, I need to definitely come back. I have no space. And another level two. Aloha Mora. Sam Detour. Rebellion. How many? I lost. Hello, Hamora. Revelio. What are we looking for today? I'm selling. I'm selling a bag of stuff. Don't need this. Don't need this. Don't need this.
Right. Tower of the inventory. inventory. It's not like Natty to be late. Yeah, she said she, she was going to the Hog's Head. Perhaps I'll find her there. Hog's Head. Ugh. See, maybe we'll run all the way there. For her to not be this one, all the way back. The way how this music is playing, it, it something don't seem right. Something seems like something's about to pop off. Do not fear, young truth. That he this, must be around here somewhere. This is the inevitable outcome. Natty's wand. She can cast without it. She wanted me to find this. She's in trouble. Ravelio will show me where she was taken. Hello, Hamora. Sorry, before that. Let's <laughs> get this lock. Locks take full priority. In this way, I need to find her quickly. Every time it does that ding sound, that sounds close. My footprints led to this room. There must be Akio. Natty must have been taken this way. I need to find her quickly. Whoa. Already I'm seeing two men. Two men, Dessa. All right. It's bare loose, all. I like this place. I'd better be sure I'm not seen. Holy shit. Would be arrogant enough to come in here. Quite a few. Quite a few. But as, as he said, we can't be seen. Just a few 
How am I meant to get past some of that? I've had enough of spell problems. I've robbed every traveling that has passed through here. Oh, you're wasting your time with her, my friend. I've seen her show more attention to a hawk. How did uh, girls be nothing but trouble about time? Oh, uh, is no Dallas. What was that? 32, Gwendolyn Zoo. Who the hell is that? She's level 32. Nah, I will get bodied. Don't even think about it. My measly level 29. I can't do nothing. Don't interrupt. Mind yourself. Understood? I don't want to work with goblins. Not now, not ever. Rook was gone mad. Am I supposed to fight? Because there's a lot of them, you know. When we're done. We need to find a way to get through. Be on the lookout for the girl's friend. We should speak to her again. Perhaps she'll tell us where we can find that friend of hers. Ah, she's determined to say nothing. The boss will deal with her when he arrives. Fuck you, man.
that was taken from Agabus Filbert. He'll be thrilled to have this back. So that's one. That's the others. Otto Dibble's love letter from Rosie. He wanted me to destroy this if I found it. Abducted. You spoke with my wife. How is she? Worried about you. Are you all right? I am all right. Thank you for coming. These locks are cursed, and there's an anti apparition jinx on the cells. Even Natty's skill with wandless magic cannot free us. I need you to find my wand. Mr. Rabe, I found your wand. Well done. I knew it was nearby. <laughs> now, you best stand back. You already knew your wand was there, man. One never oh. knows how a curse will react to being broken. Mr. Isco. My pleasure. And thank you, my friend. We owe our lives to your bravery. I may oh, be too boy. weak to disapparate with you both. Lumos. But I can try. You go ahead. Find Officer Singer. We will get out of here on our own. Very well. But be careful. Thank you, my young friend. Be prepared for a fight. These Ashwinders must pay. All right, say nothing. Oh, what is she talking about? The guys that were previously here that have already fucked up. Yeah, don't worry about that night. They're done out. <laughs> That's taken care of. Long time. We, we, we waste no time with that.
Let's find Officer Singer and put an end to Harlow one- Shut up. Natsai Onai. I should have known. And you, the troll dispatcher. Oh, thank goodness the two of you are safe. Isco Rabe told me a couple of students had rescued him. Should have known it was you two. Is Mr. Rabe all right? He is. I sent him home to his wife, Miss Onai. Your mother will not be pleased to learn that you're still risking your safety pursuing these dangerous men. Actually, Officer Singer, Natty and I learned of several Hogsmeade residents who've had their lives threatened by the Ashbinders. In addition to abducting Mr. Rabe to blackmail his wife and Natty, Rookwood and Harlow have also extorted Agabus Filbert and Otto Dibble. Uh, I will look into all of that. As for the two of you, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but you are taking great risk. Next time, please let the authorities handle the Ashwinders. Oh, understood. Yes, officer. Do you have enough evidence to take down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot? Well, it's certainly a good start. We shall see. But you can leave this to me now. All right, you already said that. Natsai, you may wish to speak with your mother about this before I do. My mother will not like this. Thank you again for rescuing me. We shall speak soon. No problem, Nats. Anytime. Right. Second side quest done. Jesus, the side quests are long as hell. But let's not dwell. Ashwinders have ceased pestering me. I suspect that's your doing. Thank you from me and Rosie both. We're just leaving for our honeymoon, after we tell Mr. Hill of our recent marriage. Wish me luck. Speak with my uncle. I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Don't think I've forgotten about your goblin friend. I haven't. But I appreciate you setting our earlier discussion aside for now. Well, what did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. Nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. <sighs> if he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, He's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form, and that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne, to reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. Okay, very well. Let me know what you find, what quest you sent. I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. You are. I'll back. send you an owl when I have news. Mm -hmm. Right. Main quest now. Flipping out. Before that, we need to go to the room of requirement. Uh, long.
just um, maintenance. you doing so far <laughs> oh my god why is that so far thank god we've got a quick travel what the hell let's go high wing some air time go high wing let's go come Wait, on high wing Race that, my friend. Akio, Expelliarmus, Confringo, Akio, Incendio, Expelliarmus, Incendio, Confringo. He's just minding his business. I have no right to run into the Spell deck can, can do with a bit of improvement because I don't really care. Put that back. Um, that's cool. You are the talk of the school since you saved Mr. Reb and I from the Ashwinders. We have come so far. We should discuss the next steps in our plan to stop Halo. Natsia, I was just finished with you. You want something again? Rebellion. I did a main mission. I keep delaying it because there's just enemies everywhere that need to get murked. Well, I wouldn't give for a cup of mushroom tea. That relic is the key to saving Anne. I know it. Meet me outside of Feldcroft as soon as you can. Hmm. 
nothing pleasant about this coast. I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time, it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They... Oh. Either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask the difficult questions. Oh, Sebastian, shut the fuck up, man. Why, why are you just making this long? I do care about Anne, but I'm tired of explaining myself. Perhaps we should part ways. Yeah, that's, man. That's not what I meant. I... We're just not getting answers. I need answers. For Anne. I know. Now, shall we see why the triptych led us here? Let's go, me. quickly, before we're spotted. Right, let's go. Keep a close eye out. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. I wonder why. Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables. But it's been abandoned ever since Ranrock took hold of the coast. Only following orders. Leave your accusations in someone else's direction. One there. I won't rest. Ah! 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 Nice work. How do you do that? If I'm doing incendio. Thestrals overhead. Some consider them a bad omen. Hmm. Not everyone does. I know that. All right. I'm making small talk. I'm not going to trek up this mountain in silence. Why not? It's the best thing, Sebastian. Shut him up. Just talking about us. What's there to chat about when we're trying to do this mission? Got to stay focused, mate. Man, he's pissing me off lately. I bet the best Look how far behind you are. What are you there doing? Come on. Good for you. I'm sorry we can both see Thestrals. Certainly not something I'd hoped we'd have in common. Again, what do these... These vegetables are just asking to get tech away. Hold on. Can we go? Oops. That's a mark. Arrest the momentum.
There's the other one. Revelio. So what do I do with this then? Arrest the momentum. No. Accio. No. Expelliant. No. Clasius. No. Bombarda. No. Flopendo. Oh. Is that what we do? We do flopendo. Oh, to match the symbol. Is that what it is? Oh, gotcha. Revelio. Thank you, guy. You try to leave, innit? Arrest the momentum. I'll try that. I don't know where you think you're going. You ain't going nowhere. Sorry. to do this then. See, it works. Like, what? Well, I didn't even do nothing. Thank you. 
Revelio. Kill any of you trespass. Wait, we should have some sort of plan. I'm through planning. So quietly now. Man says he just wants beef. He just wants smoke. Enjoy suffering, do you? No! That's better than this! Oh, you're making this stop! In some way! Fuck you! You're not gonna die! Rubendo! Rubber and white coming back this way! That's what I'm gonna do! Thinking. I was thinking about dead goblins. You could have got us killed, but I didn't. Okay, so that's Looks like we're joyless. We're heading further up the path. Let's, Let's keep going. He has a don't give a fuck at you. Ramrock's gonna make everyone pay. Anything made from goblin silver belongs to us. Whether it's a sword or a repository, whatever that is. Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. Good wizards a dead wizard. Ranrock's got that right. Oh. This 
must be his. Sebastian, He's got wait, this again a bit, wait, again a bit more for what? Uh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen to me. I know you're angry and frustrated, but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lord Gok said, Oh, your goblin friend. Stop it. That's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing. To find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. There's some conflict going Lord on. Lord Gok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine, fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. Mm -hmm. And I have been for a while. I do question. trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Agreed. Peace. So far, so good. Charming. Spiders. Revelio. Fitting. Incendio. Good for you. Oh, shit. What? Incendio. Expelliarmus. Of another spider. I shall sleep better tonight. Incendio! Kundringo! Ah, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. So, what was the point of that? I was behind it. One nudge and that chest might have fallen. Oh, I think three nudges at least. What's with Sebastian? These spiders are determined to make a meal of us. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. Here. It's a... Who's Rico? 
Incendio. Accio. Expelliarmus. Heavy Army Pulsar. Incendio. Pegasus. Glacius. Cruelty. That spell got my attention. Annoying little beast. A staircase leading here. Whatever for? I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Let me know, sir. Confringo! Look at this place. Not really my style. A bit much, if you ask me. What? Spider galore. Woo 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 woo! We've seen rune symbols like these before. Yeah, we have. This is one. Confringo! Should be the third one somewhere. Ooh, of course, because my slots are full again. Every I really hate this limitation with slots. It's so annoying. Can't get out of here quick enough. Should be like an unlimited slot repository because this is just doing dumb Merlin quest to increase my slots. It's just And of course, go to
Good sick, don't get hit by that thing. Oh, I, I bloody use protect. Oh, I'm still alive. Thank God. Still alive. No, I, I dodged. That's bullshit. <laughs> no way. I. That's. That's pissed. I dodged. Oh. Nah, this is crap. Hold on. I dodged. That's bullshit. I'm slacking. I need to get back on top of my game. Because what? an angry troll to bring friends together just what a load of crap died twice i don't like that sign the rules broke rules only die once dying twice is just not forgivable nah no, i can blame it on the fact that i've been on mia for like the past what, nine ten days it's a little still still rusty yeah i'm still rusty That was a piece of work. More than one.
A journal entry. Isadora was here. Ah, oh, this gear thing really gets in my nerves. Let's destroy it. Revelio. Accio. Guardian Leviosa. Accio. Guardian Leviosa. Leviosa. I'm out of breath after all of those stairs, but the view, well worth it. Okay, Sebastian. Another barrier. We can pass through it. Certain. Good news. This journal entry sounds worrisome. Revelio. This can't be a dead end. Must be another floor above us. Confirm. Ah, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. Mm -hmm. This place can't have belonged to only Isadora. But the triptych pointed us here. Another rune symbol. Feel as if I should be fluent in runic language by now. Rebellion. Where is the third one? Oh, that's annoying. Oh, that's annoying. Couldn't bring up. Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. That would be interesting. The final canvas piece to the triptych! We've done it! Thank Isadora God. should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. Perhaps completing the triptych will shed more light on all of this. Yes, let's go back and see what's, what's been uncovered in the underground. Oh, thank God for that. Because oh, that was annoying. That troll. I Not cannot twice. believe the journey this triptych took us on. Yeah, tell This you. is it. Don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing. I wonder... What is it? Let's find out. Yes, let's. I can't 
cannot bring my brother back, Father. But I can give you peace. You don't want no peace. You don't want none of this. Please, have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Oh, yeah, I have seen this before. She's going to take away his pain. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. Put it in the jar. So I'll be seeing this again. On my travels. I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. Have you done? I took his pain. Thank you. Oh, that's me cough the last time. That worked. It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Pain. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this unnerves them. Not oh, everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. But someone will be. <gasps> she took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felgroff, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes. Yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The mm -hmm. Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain, it's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care, if at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. I wonder if that's going to be Avada Kedavra. Somehow mixed with the mod, with the, I don't know. Avada Kedavra. Please, talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then, then for Anne. Man, I ain't even doing it for Anne. Why did the Keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Yeah. Why destroy her portrait? Well, it is interesting, but you know what time it is. I think we're gonna wrap up here, leave it right here. 
after my hiatus, I've grown quite tired. <laughs> and I don't think I can carry this on much longer. I need to get... I need to get myself some shadow. One of Randrock's drills in a mine along the shore. I intend to destroy it. I'm tired of trying to reason with him. You're welcome to join me, but if I don't see you there, I will reach out when I return. I have something to give you. Lord God's getting himself into more danger than he realizes. I'd better find him. Yeah, we ain't gonna find him tonight. I'll <laughs> tell you that, we ain't gonna find him tonight. Uh, we're gonna find him tomorrow and hopefully finish off this entire game because I think we must be near completion surely so yeah tomorrow we're just gonna wrap everything up hopefully but yeah let me be right here I've been your host Mr. Hewitt thank you for viewing until next time peace about finding tonight <laughs> we, we ain't gonna find that we, we ain't gonna find it tonight we'll find it tomorrow i'll tell you that